An honest WellSat Labs review as of right now. I'm going to compare this to Murph AI and see if WellSat Labs is a better text to speech generator than Murph AI. I want you to know that I've been using WellSat Labs as well as Murph AI for a while now, and I have paid plans on both software, meaning I can give you an honest and legit opinion on both softwares. So if you're not sure which one to choose as of right now, I'll tell you exactly which one is better for you. With that being said, let's jump right into this. So I'm currently in Well Set Labs. Now, one of the most important parts, of course, are the voices. I think that's the most important part. Then after that, you'll get usability and of course pricing. So that is what we're gonna cover today. Starting off with voices, you can see that there are many available on Well Set Labs. And I must admit, all of them, almost all of them are very, very good. Well Set Labs is one of the best ones to make it sound like an actual human being. So I'll play a few for you right now. I've also made a video where I play all of them. I'll leave a link to that in the description down below. But for now, I'll play a few. Your creative life will evolve in ways that you can't possibly imagine. Trust your, your creative life will evolve in ways that you can't possibly imagine. Your creative life will evolve in ways that you can't possibly imagine. So you can see Vanessa sounded a little bit more robotic than Celine, for example. I use Celine most of the time, but you've got many more like Sophia. Your creative life will evolve in ways that you can't possibly imagine. And the list goes on and on. Once again, I've made that video playing all of them. I'll leave a link to that in the description down below. But what you can get from this is that on WellSat Labs, the voices do sound very, very accurate compared to real human beings. And I'll play one right now. For example, this one. If you haven't heard the news yet, let me be the first to tell you, YouTube Shorts are going to be monetized in 2023, and this is a game changer. This presents a massive opportunity for everyone who is interested in making money with YouTube automation. At you see how great that sounds? I was just playing around with that for a little script for my main channel, just testing out what it would sound like, and you can see that sounds pretty, pretty accurate. So in terms of the voices on WellSat Labs, do they win it over Murph? Well, let's find out. So if I open up my Amsterdam project here in Murph, I can show you what the voices sound like. I've actually made a full video playing all of them as well. I'll leave a link to that in the description down below. So are these voices any good? Yes, they are. They're not bad at all. So what I want to do right now is play tarot for you. It only takes one voice at the right pitch to start an avalanche. So that is what tarot sounds like. Now I can also play it here in the script. Did you know that Amsterdam has more canals than Venice? So that still sounds pretty good. So the voices on Murph AI are definitely not bad. It's just that the amount available that actually are good is a little bit less. And I'll tell you why that makes sense later on in the video as well. But they do have a lot of great voices. For example, Ava, she's not in the pro plan, but I can select her, generate the audio, and you'll see that even this one that is not in the pro plan sounds pretty good as well. Did you know that Amsterdam has more canals than Venice? Sounds pretty all right, definitely for a non-pro plan. So the voices on Murph, to give you my real opinion, are still good. They're pretty good. Are they perfect? Are they the best in the game? No, they're not. Well said Labs voices in terms of how they read it are a little bit better, but we'll also see that back in the pricing, which I'll cover in a bit. In terms of usability, I like Murph AI more than Well said Labs because the studio that they've built is very convenient, the layouts, the way it works is so much better. I've made a full platform tutorial about Murphy AI as well, in case you want to learn how it works. Check the links in the description down below. But I like the usability, the layout much more compared to WellSet Labs. You can see this is what WellSet Labs looks like. Like if you just look at it, you're not quite sure like where everything is, where to find it. You can find it here on the right hand side. Whereas with Murph, it makes a bit more sense. It's a white layout, which is cool. You've got import script makes sense. You've got app media, makes total sense, voice changer. All of the features are clear. It's easy to understand how to change the speed, the pitch, the tone. You can do everything. You can add pauses. So the usability on Murph AI, I like a little bit more than WellSet Labs. So voices, WellSet Labs wins it over Murph AI, not by far, but it's definitely better. And then usability wins it a little bit over WellSet Labs. So then we're going to take a look at the pricing. Of course, not unimportant. So WellSet Labs for the most popular plan is $98 a month, which is the one that I currently have. Then you also have the Make Your Plan, which is 44. The problem there is that you only have five projects and 300 downloads, which is not that much if you want to upload a lot of videos. You can get started with a free trial. They allow you to do so. 
which is pretty good. But on Murph AI, it's kind of the same. They allow you to get started with a free trial, and the monthly plans are $39 a month for the Pro plan, which is cheaper than both options on WellSet Labs, which here is the Pro plan, and here it is just a standard plan, the one to get started with. So in terms of pricing, Murph AI is cheaper, so it wins it over WellSet Labs, but you do have to also keep in mind that the voices then on WellSet Labs are a little bit better. So I would say, if you have the budget, if you can easily pay this right here, and you don't mind at all, that is easy for you to do, then I would choose WellSet Labs. But if this is a bit tight, I would go with Murph AI, and then I would choose the Pro plan. If you've got the money, pay upfront so you can get a big discount. It's about one third of a discount here, um, so that you can get all of the voices on Murph AI as well. Now, what I like is that both softwares are actual companies. They don't seem like cash grabs, like Speechello, for example, where they just make it and then they try to milk it out like crazy. These are actual companies that will continue to improve. Murph AI is adding features quite often as well as new voices. For example, they just added this in where you can add the tone, like shouting, unfriendly, whispering. I'll leave a link for that in the description down below to that tutorial video that explains it all. Um, but both software is pretty good. So with that being said, I'll leave platform guides tutorials, as well as free trial links, as well as more resources for both in the description down below in case you're still not sure which one to choose. And then you can learn more about the softwares there. For now, which one wins? Well set labs in terms of voices, Merv AI in terms of usability and pricing. With that being said, I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like on this video, subscribe, let me know if you have any questions down below, and then I'll see you in the next video.